An 87 year old man died over the weekend after his camper caught fire. The fire happened Saturday morning at a campground in Lapel. Right now, the cause of the fire is still under investigation. As Fox 59's Lindsay Eaton explains, firefighters have a safety reminder for all of us. Here at the Glowwood Campground in Lapel, this is where a weekend fire turned deadly. You just hope for a different outcome than what we got Saturday. Around 7 o'clock Saturday morning, a neighbor called 911 to report a camper was on fire, and that person did what they could to help. What we heard was that the neighbor um, did try to go open the door, um, but the fire was taking over, uh, so there was n no nothing to be heard from the person inside. When fire crews arrived, the camper was fully engulfed. First responders tried to get inside, but the fire was too powerful. An 87-year-old man sadly died. The Madison County coroner has identified that victim as John Meadows. Officials talked to neighbors and learned he had been staying at the campground since September. They just said he was a nice guy. He kept to himself. They said they took him food, made sure he was taken care of. They said there was no issues with them. Pictures show crews putting the fire out. You can see a couple cars nearby that were also damaged in the fire. Jessica Marvel is an EMT with the Pell Stony Creek Township Fire Territory. I think each situation is different. Marvel was on scene for this fire, and tonight she's reminding everyone to be prepared for an emergency. This is the first deadly fire in Lapel this year, and she hopes it's the last. Have smoke detectors above every bedroom, you know, throughout the house. We often tell people, change the batteries every time time changes. Um, we like to teach kids um, when we do public safety to always have an escape plan. In Lapel, Lindsay Eaton, Fox 59 News. The cause of this fire is still under investigation. Leaders at Indiana University are addressing last week's racially motivated